there it is. Babe. Mike, look at this house. You're loving it already, I can see. This is the house that I've always dreamed of having. But, uh, you know, that price, let's see what that gets us. OK, wait. Check out the pillars in the front. Double yeah. doors. Yep. Looks very regal, don't you think? All this right. This center staircase, like, it's exactly what I've always envisioned. It's like envisioned. your mini Juliet. It's perfect. Hello there. I yes. do like it. <laughs> I do like it. Just check out this hardwood, like, the color. Were they recently stained? Yes, they have been. All right. So we have another space. Oh, there's a whole, for other, Dom. whole yes. other family room. Yeah. Is this, but does this work? It does Still work, yes. You. That's what comes with a colonial a fireplace. Uh, that doesn't look like a real fireplace. Certainly not a fireplace Is worth $600,000. The kitchen's nice. But it would be nice if, like, there was, like, a flow, you know? It does have, you know, the updated appliances, the countertops. Are these granite? Yes, it is. Yeah. OK. So the cabinets are pretty modern. I know you wanted it a little bit brighter, but... Yeah. but like, I... We can change the color. That's paint. That's you true. Know? Yeah. yeah. But what is this? Why is there such a chunk, like, in the middle of the kitchen? It just kind of closes off the kitchen. It looks so small. It doesn't feel open. I would, like, take this chunk out right here <laughs> and just expand the whole kitchen. That's not a touch-up, right? If yeah. We're, if we're chopping all of this down and then maybe looking to knock this wall and really make it all open, that is a pretty big investment. You can do that later down the line. I mean, the kitchen's doable. Thank you. Wow. This is really It nice. is a brand new deck. A, they just installed it. But yeah. I don't think you're going to be able to put a pool in this yard. So it's got a pretty significant slope right here. Yeah. I think you're losing the Even pool on this one. as he's growing up, it would be nice if he could have one, if we could have one. There is a first floor bedroom and also a half a bath. I love the floors in this bathroom. So again, it's also recently updated. I do like it. It's yeah. a nice bathroom. It would be nice if that was a full. Yeah. I can see a shower. I can see, yeah. Right but here. But you're going to have to move this. You're going to have to move the toilet. You're going to have to maybe move that sink. I mean, I like... Toilet I can stay. Sink can stay. Shower right here. So let's take a look at this room. Great space for the parents. You know, it's on, yeah, it's on the first level. They don't have to go up any stairs. Yeah. So this is a primary, nice okay. size. Hey, take a look at this bathroom. Oh, I like the bathroom. I yeah, really yeah. like this bathroom. It's nice and bright. You have a lot of room to play around. Mm -hmm. You know, it could be Dom's room. OK. Over here, guys, you also have a full bath and the rest of the two bedrooms. OK. OK. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. Again, updated. The colors, you know, are on the darker side, but it's a nice guest or, like, um, second bathroom. Yes. Can't wait to see this basement. Yes. OK. Right. <laughs> Look at oh, all this OK. Space. All right. Yeah, this yes. is all huge. of this. This is what I'm talking about. It's got a lot of potential. Yes. The In floors are the done. Space, the floors are done. I Ready like that. for you, yeah. Yeah, but, so um, we don't have to worry about putting anything down. I'm sure I feel about the color. That's, that's just a slab of yes. I like the house, but the bathroom needs to be upgraded, right? The kitchen needs to be upgraded. And considering the market, are we going to have to be aggressive with this bid? The market that we're in, yes, we do have to. We could be up to 700. No, we're not going that high, I doubt that, right? We might go slightly over, but it's a colonial. And with that, you have the five bedrooms, all these space. You don't get the pool, you don't get the backyard. I mean, honestly, I, I like the house, I just, I hate the price. This is a little smaller than I uh, envisioned. We have yeah. to think positive. I know, I know. I like the front porch. Definitely yeah. see a couple of... I mean, Rocking chairs. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> definitely. Come on Thank in. Thank you. I like the floors and the finish. Was this, is this fully renovated? Yes, fully renovated. Floors are also refinished. Okay. There's some blemishes, the... but it's, you can't go wrong with original yeah, hardwood. That's the character terrain. that they're trying to pull off. The living room space could be a little bit bigger, but I do like that it flows from the kitchen. I mean, that's. That was the first thing that hit me. I, I the like the aspiring it. chef. Yeah. But it's still small. The aspiring chef. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing my rounds. I'm, I'm making my way. 
And you like white? Are the appliances? I like to white. Uh, yes. Are the appliances all new? Yes. Everything is brand new. Everything is brand new. Okay. I like the grain. I like the, the it's design. Nice, it, yeah. it, it is very nice. This kitchen space is definitely nice, but I feel like it takes up more than half of this main level. So there's not a lot of living space. Mm -hmm. This whole level looks pretty turnkey, so I mean, that's, um, but we that's can't, definitely a plus. We can't think fit so, yeah. our eight-seat dining room table over there. We'll take the leaf out, and it'll be six. It'll, it'll, it'll fit. Okay. So we have one bath off the kitchen, and there's one upstairs? Yep. Okay. I don't know how I feel about the bathroom right off the right kitchen. Right off the kitchen? Yeah. But, well, I mean, you know, looks... Wow, okay. This is amazing. I like the finish. I like it. Nice banister. I like how they redid the spokes. Wow. Everything's just white. This is gorgeous. I like the bathroom. Okay, this is one of the first bedroom, you guys. I like the um, light fixture. Yeah. I like the finish. It's, it's a little bit on the smaller side, but it does yeah. have a really nice view. Okay, this would be your okay. second. It does feel on the small side. I mean, unless it's a baby room. Okay. Yeah. So I can definitely see this is probably the primary because it's slightly bigger. I can see like a nice bed in this room, some nightstand. So I think- King or queen, because our king isn't fitting in here. <laughs> definitely. <laughs> He's like that price tag right now is like, yeah, you know, we could work with that. But space is very limited. We love to cook, we love to host. If anyone wants to spend the night, I'd be like, I'm sorry, you know, you might have to crash on the floor in a living room. An unfinished basement. Yes. Okay. There's a lot of room at the price I think point. So. At yeah, the price yeah. point. That's you what know, I was... we, we do have some ability to, to make updates. There's three bedrooms or four? Three. Three okay. bedrooms. So one for us, one for Dom, and one for guests. And I guess. But there's no room for growth. This would be the growth area. Like down here, down, you could make this. Down here, right. right. Well, you can have your office down here. We'll put him down office here. Space. How about you just sleep down here? I'll just sleep upstairs. I've got my own emergency exit. You'll never know. Oh, my God. <laughs> the backyard. It's on a hill. Yeah, I think we'd still host a get together. Do you think we can put an above ground pool there? <laughs> we're not. We're not putting. <laughs> I mean, we're not putting a pool here. You could. You we're, could we're definitely if you... not putting a pool here. I do think it has enough rooms for us right now mm -hmm. uh, as a family. I like that the main area is turnkey. That basement definitely needs a lot needs of work. Some work. You know, there, there's definitely some potential here. I am really concerned about the space accommodating family and growth. You know, because I'd rather grow into something, mm -hmm. and I feel here will be maxed. Hey, Teresa. Hello, hello. Hi, guys. The garden is I like, beautiful. I like the garden. This was 600? Yes. Property taxes? Around 13. Around 13? Yep, we're okay. at 13. And is this a split-level ranch? Yes, it is. Your favorite? <laughs> hey, it <laughs> works. Take a look. It works. <laughs> I'll be glad. open. I'm glad, OK. <laughs> so uh, we'll start upstairs. They do have some nice floors that was just refinished. I like the floors. I know you wanted more of an open concept, airy feel. Actually, I have seen most homes that have been updated similar to this style, okay. that they have opened up those two walls. That works, like, at least if we're in the kitchen, we can it see does. Dominic playing. Yeah. It okay. does. You know, I'm not, I'm not really excited about more projects at this price point. But there is more to the house. I'd love yeah. for you guys to see. Let's take a look. Yeah, nice deck outside. I love this cabinet, really. It's so light, and it does brighten up this space. But I feel it just, like, maybe an island could go here. I could overlook, like, the bar, and I can see what Dominic's doing and be able to cook at the same time. So we're going to have more than protein shakes for dinner? No! <laughs> How do you jump from Dominic <laughs> to protein shakes? How about we stop intermittent fasting, and you can have breakfast with us? OK, emerging so, yeah. chef. <laughs> okay. Over here, you guys would have your three bedroom and two full baths. I like. So all the bathrooms in the home are, have been fully updated. Okay. I like it. Oh. This would be your primary bedroom. Okay. I think it's got a good size. I do love how the bathrooms, both bathrooms have the same theme. You can't go wrong. It's a well, lot of the colors. Yeah. This could be a good room maybe for Dominic. I know you're not a fan of the split-level ranch, but you can see this property. It's definitely got all the rooms we need. I'm staying open. I mean, if we got my pool, then I'm super happy. 
So the two bedrooms are down here. Mm, okay. I like the size, but the carpet, it's old. Yeah. I would have preferred the hardwood throughout. Okay, okay. I do understand. I would say that with the potential, you have a window. Mm -hmm. It is a nice size room for a guest. It's like <laughs> Hotel California down here. Okay, <laughs> okay. Motel <laughs> California, look at this rug. I like the bar, but... The, There's a bar! <laughs> the, the, the frosted, like, 1930s glass. <laughs> I mean, it is Listen, easy, updatable. I can see a little potential in this space. There's a lot of sunlight streaming in. Yes. This is great entertaining area. So the patio is nice. This is updated. I love the pool. OK, good, because that's why I brought you here. That's a winner for me. That's yeah. awesome. Well, I love the pool. And we've got a pretty nice backyard space here yeah, for Dominic. Huge. Yeah. My whole mood just changed when I came out here. I feel happy. I feel like we can have parties. I want to jump in the pool right now. The space, the amount of rooms, the bathrooms, very exciting to see that we can still, like, have enough space to grow a family and host. I think it's got a lot of the, the things we're looking for in terms of, like, the pool, the yeah. backyard. Um, but honestly, just Again, at that price point, there are a bunch of projects downstairs. I do see the concerns. This price point at a house, what you're getting, this is going to get snatched up. One, mm -hmm. two, three. Up. There mm -hmm. you go. We decided to go with the Colonial. We absolutely love it. We have space. Dominic is running around. It is at the top of the price point, but at this point, uh, you know, the extra room is going to come in handy. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? It's a secret. Not really. <sighs> yes, we're expecting. Hey! <laughs> I think he should get the bigger room, not the smaller room, right? No. What do you think, Dom? No. Well, the list on this was $5.99. We knew we had to be a bit aggressive on the bid, so we went over um, and ended up paying six twenty-five. dollars Being the, the, the financial guy, you know, I'm, I'm trying to make sure we're prepared, but I think for that price point, we got a lot of value, just in terms of the space. Come in. Hi. Okay. I would say the proximity to her parents has been gold. Lovely. It has, it has been gold, fantastic. They've been by to help with unpacking, just watching the baby. Can I see my room? In terms of future plans, so one of the things we did definitely want was the uh, the open concept design. There is a, uh, a non-load bearing wall there that we plan to probably just knock down. We can modernize the space a little bit by painting a nice shiny gloss. You know, the bathroom, you can put a shower in there. It could be like a oh, guest wing. Yes. Yep. When my family transitioned to this country, when we were in Trinidad, we had, we had some space. When we came here, you know, it was really a reset. Seeing all the space where Dominic could run around, having his own room, having all this space um, feels really fulfilling. It's great. It's nice. 